There are two things that apply to all of the crosses, with some exception to the manual. The more you fill the power bar, the farther will your cross go and the faster will it be. The other thing is that by pressing directional buttons you decide how close or far from the goalkeeper will the ball go. For example, if you press directional button towards your own goal, the cross will go somewhere between the penalty spot and the penalty arc. If you press directional button towards opponent's goal, the ball will go nearer the 6-yard box, closer to goalkeeper. These are the types of crosses in Pro Evolution Soccer 2017. 1. Regular cross. Normal cross where your player crosses into the box. For him to do it automatically, you have to pass the imaginary 18-yard line. 2. High cross. Cross which is a little slower and has a higher trajectory. 3. Low cross. Similar to low pass, but stronger. 4. Precise cross. Very efficient kind of cross where your player will aim your player in the box. It's great for situations where you have only one attacker in the box. You can combine this kind of cross with regular, high and low crosses. 5. Manual cross. You have a complete control of your cross. Probably best to leave this one to the full manual players. 6. Rabona cross. It's a cross performed by a player who possesses the Rabona skill. It's really just an animation and for showing off. Your player will do it if he's in a situation where he should use his weaker foot. For example, a lefty on a right wing should cross with his right foot, but instead does a Rabona, 